Magic with Madison. This is day 15 of Vlogmas. So today we're going to be opening up two advent calendars, Skein in the Stitch and Fiber Fox. So we'll open those up and then we'll chat. Let's start with the Fiber Fox. And here is Skein and the Stitch. Some really lovely colors came out today. Really, really enjoyed those. Obviously, Skin in the Stitch is going into greens, kind of apple-y colors, whereas Fiber Fox is going into more of those reds, pinkies tones. So today's color was called the Enchanted Rose. So it really is that kind of rosy pink color. And we'll see how that transitions. I'm guessing it'll go darker in terms of color. So in terms of my knitting projects, I'm still working on my Lace and Fade Boxy by Hohi Locatelli. I've got that stitch marker to show one side from Charmed and Dangerous, Holly. And I'm now working on the other side, as you can see where my needles are. And I'm going to join in the round in a bit. I still have a full lace section to do and a section in that pink that we're seeing on the bottom there. And then I'll be able to join in the round. So it's progressing. It'll be nice to get to that point. Hopefully I'll get to that point in the next few days and be working on this in the round, which will make this a lot easier. Also, I'm in a new location today. I have Christmas tree in the background, so I thought that was much more Christmassy for the rest of Vlogmas. So I'll try and sit here and include this for the rest of my Vlogmases. Other than that, let's jump into talking about some books. So today I'm reminded that yesterday I briefly touched on the Artemis Fowl series, so I thought I'd touch more on it today. I think the book that I liked the most about the Artemis Fowl series was the first one, the one with the golden cover with the lock and the kind of mystical writing on the front. Um, that was probably my favorite of the series. I didn't love the series going forward, but it was the one that kind of gave you the most in terms of world building and feeling like you were in kind of a fantastical world. And I really recommend that one. So really, really enjoyed that. And that was a fun read from my childhood. I think I still like this series, unfortunately, but better, but, and probably the Tortal series better um, because I love being able to live in a world for a long time. But when it came to Artemis Fowl, I kind of just liked that one book and didn't really like the books that came after it, didn't like the rest of the series. So that's a fun one. Other than that, I'm um, hoping to continue on with these projects. I still have one sock to knit for Sockmas, which is supposed to be for this Friday, um, but we'll see how I do about that with the socks that I've been showing you. And 
other than that, we also have some lonely knitters to open up um, later on in the week. So that'll be super fun. You'll get to see those. And that's pretty much it. Pretty quick episode today. Not lots going on, but it's fun and it's a beautiful day. So we got to spend some time outside and I uh, hope you have a great one.